Him. Oh, is something the matter? Yeah, something. We haven't seen you at practice for the longest time. We got worried and decided to come see you. I see. My sincerest apologies. Something wrong? Well, truth be told, something is worrying me. Yes. So, what's the problem? It's about my dancing. Watching everyone's routines has moved me greatly and provided me with such joy. Is anyone influenced at all by my own concepts? I think your style's cool, Yusuke. I appreciate that. But what's important is whether or not I'm satisfied with it. I may have become too fixated on techniques and methodology. Humans can be moved by emotion itself. How could I forget one of my earliest lessons? That's gotta be tough for you. Tell me, what's your highest priority when you're dancing? To enjoy. Hey, yeah! I'm the same way! If you and the crowd are both having fun, isn't that enough? Can it really be that simple? Then, let me ask you, Yusuke. Why do you dance? Dancing is... enjoyable. If people could derive pleasure from my own, that would be joyous indeed. Then we're all in the same boat. To be honest, everyone else's dances were so vivid, uh, I was awestruck. Perhaps it was a sense of inferiority which led me to shut myself in here. But thanks to the both of you, I came to a realization. The subject of my awe included none other than myself. How's that? This is not mere conceit, but critically endorsed self-praise. Oh, um, I don't get it. However, I won't rest on my laurels. I want to take a fresh look at my techniques. I'm going out. I must make up for the time I've wasted. W Yusuke! Hey, hold on! I 
your back. Hey, how about this? Knock this one out. All right, get the job done. Good. Clear. <sighs> Got through that somehow. Nice job. That was pretty good.
Brilliant!
Brilliant! What are you getting all comfy for? Break time's over. Let's get back to practicing. I'm so tired. My HP's still low. Sleepy time now. Come on, don't be lazy. If you get off your ass and try a little harder, it'll pay off, I swear. What about you? Think you can keep going? Do you have infinite stamina or something? You guys aren't human. Don't hold me to your crazy standards. I'm not made for this. I'm not that much different, but it's no pain, no gain, you know? If you just give up when the going gets tough, you'll never get any better. Well, it's the same way we all manage to get through stuff with the Phantom Thieves, yeah? I guess that's true. Not gonna lie, I feel like quitting all the time, but that's when you gotta try the hardest. I don't want to look back on it someday and regret being a lazy bum. Half-assing things just ain't my style. So come on, if we're gonna do it, let's go all the way. Such wise words. Like a real senpai. So moe. You know, I really was a senpai to my track team back in middle school. Ryuji senpai. Huh. Nope, can't see it. you know, I was the talk of the team. They called me Sprint Master Sakamoto. People put letters in my shoe locker and waited for me after the meet. Oh man, that takes me back. Objection! That backstory doesn't fit your character. But it's true! And why are you talking to me like I'm some anime character? Ugh, enough chat. I'm gonna go back to practicing. Oh well, guess if I'm the brains, you're the brawn. I'll come along just this once, Ryuji Paisen. It's Senpai. Who died and made you queen? There's no time to waste. Hop to it, Paisen. Shut it! I call the shots here, rookie. Should we leapfrog our way there? Hippity hop! Hell no!
understand. Time to show our stuff. Nice, everybody. Get set. Let's show them what we got. What do you think of this team effort? Let's move out, fellow thieves. Time to dance. Let's elegance. Me too. <laughs> this is turning out pretty good, huh? Let's do this, Ryuji. You got it. Here I come.
can still go even higher. Keep it up. You really do have a dependable knack for this kind of stuff. girl's room. Not a single piece of trash in sight. Um, hello to you too. It may be peculiar, but she's offering you praise. Consider it her admiration of your tidiness. Don't exaggerate things. You'll give her a big head. It's common sense to clean up for visitors, especially when they're as generous as us. <laughs> That's true. I do owe you a lot. I never would have attempted dancing if you two hadn't brought me here. Ha! You're on the right track! You'd better dance hard to show us your gratitude. What Caroline means to say is that she would enjoy seeing more of your dances. Can it? Would you stop putting words in my mouth? You two seem close. I may be overreaching here, but... Don't forget your big sister either, all right? How sudden. I'm not sure I understand. Yeah, what was that about? Our sister is none of your business. I'm sorry if I made you uncomfortable. It's just... I've been thinking things over since I got here. To me, my sister is my biggest supporter. And my biggest rival. Your rival? Not your enemy? Yes. That's how I see it. You know, just like you, I've been preoccupied with the need to prove myself to my sister. Whenever she failed to acknowledge me, I was crushed. It was really getting under my skin. But eventually, I realized why I felt that way. It's because I had profound respect for her. <laughs> so you were begging to be recognized? How pathetic. Listen up. We're gonna make our sister recognize us. They're completely different. Your brain's the size of a flea, inmate. In any case, what kinds of tactics do you use to gain your sister's recognition? Nothing in particular, just trying out new things. Like this. What? How is that supposed to work? Well, 
it's not so much the activity itself that matters. It's more that by subjecting myself to different experiences, I'll continue to learn and grow. By striving to become the best person I can be, someday I'll be able to inspire her too. I see. Instead of competing to prove your worth, you'll grow to become someone she can look up to. What a clever way to earn her respect. Maybe that approach could work on your sister too. What kind of person is she? Difficult to explain. She's a curious one. She makes trips to the outside world and returns with endless amounts of food. So she's a big spender. More accurately, she's absurd. She has no sense of moderation. If she finds something she likes even a little bit, she'll bring back so much you can't see the floor. Huh? It was fine when it was takoyaki or even those seaweed potato chips. Weird brown kinako powder was disgusting. We were covered in it. The velvet room was utterly caked in kinako. You could say it was more like the brown room. Our brother shed tears as he cleaned it up. That's quite unique. Our other sister is calmer, but she can be rather eccentric as well. Like busting out puns and then scoring her own cleverness. She made our brother write puns late into the night only to say, boring, and reject them all. Even I pitied him. Their sisters sound a little quirky. Or more like extremely quirky. We can go on if you're interested. You're lucky we care so much. I'd like to hear about your own sister as well. Would you tell us more about her? Of course, I wouldn't mind. Hey, wait, hold on! your back. This is pretty damn cool. Let's do it. Looking good. Don't freak out. Just go for it.
stays clear. from here. My emails and texts just fail to go through. It seemed like all outside connections had been blocked. But suddenly, I picked up a signal on the other end. I tried hacking into it, and... Bingo! I sent out a message, and they actually replied. The net is so vast, it's linked to our dreams! But as we were talking, the connection cut out. Their screen name was Lucia. That's about all I found out. But still, that's pretty good. So what do you think? Crazy, huh? Right? What a cool mystery. I knew you'd understand. I think Lucia was trying to find a connection to the outside world, just like I was. They must be nearby. They seem like kindred spirits. I want to try to find them. <laughs> Yep, talking to people isn't so bad after all. I'm getting better at dancing, too. Feel free to praise me. It's weird. I almost can't believe it. I started out afraid to leave my room, and here I am getting up in front of everyone to dance. But because of that, I learned some things. When I try to express myself in words, I keep overthinking everything. But dancing is different. There's no time to overanalyze. You just let it all out. That's a first for me. But now that I've tried it, it feels pretty good. To be honest, I'm getting into it. It's because I earned tons of XP. I've leveled up in more than just dance. You know, our whole team is so understanding. They even put up with weirdos like me. But I can't stay in that comfort zone forever. So that's why... That's why... I'm not gonna run away! I need to face my fears head on! If I can do that, I'll find whole new worlds waiting to be explored! I have to try it! By the way, I came up with one more goal. Someday, we'll open a second LeBlanc, but it'll be a dance club cafe! You'll be the owner, of course. I'm looking forward to it. Great minds think alike. Don't go forgetting about it after we wake up, okay? Oh, I almost forgot. I was gonna ask those twins to give me the deets on our internet connection here. I better go do that before I forget again. Just chill and do whatever while I'm gone.
got your back. I got your back. Give it to me. Now we're talking. Don't freak out. Just go for it. this instant. Morgana, unleash your wild side.
Mr. Hood. Smooth motions. Keep going. Stage clear. That was so-so. I'll push myself further next time. A pleasing result. You'll keep improving at this rate.